Hello friends, welcome to my channel Creative Art. My name is Thalma and today we are going to paint this beautiful Madhubani painting of peacock and fishes. As this painting has come up so beautiful friends, so I'll just explain it for you. There are two beautiful peacocks made in the center of this painting and the whole circle is covered with fishes. And these fishes really look very beautiful with this design I have given in the border side and this pink flowers. The color combination is really very good. This is one of my favorite Madhwani painting I have did and I'm going to show you the full view of it. This is how beautiful it looks. So those who are new to my channel, please do subscribe my channel to watch more creative art painting videos and do press the bell icon to get notifications for each video I post every week. All the materials required to make this beautiful Madhwani painting are mentioned in the description box below as well as shown in the video. To get this image to use it as a reference, please do click on the link www.creativeathome.com which is my website. First of all, let's check out all the materials which were required for Madhubani painting also called as Mithila painting. First of all, I'm going to show you the papers I used, our handmade sheets. This is smooth texture, freely available in shops or art shops. If you don't get this, you can also use a Chitrapat handmade sheet. You'll get it in the description box. Secondly, we'll require color. For coloring on paper, I use Camlin Artist watercolors. You can also use Artist poster colors if you want, but I find watercolors the best. For coloring on acrylic sheet or acrylic canvas, do use acrylic paint. The next thing is Cam waterproof gel ink pen I use a black color you can also use any other brand like Reynolds you'll also require a Camlin pen brush alternatively you can also use a black marker I use two round brushes one is number eight and second is number one you can also use number zero and the second brush is flat number three civil hair brush and for creating this kind of texture I have used 261 metallic gold Camlin glass liner which I generally use in my glass painting and for coloring I have used two colors this is for the pink I have used acrylic color uh, the blue part I have done using pearl metallic blue color the, and the color part you can see it is done using Camlin artist watercolors and the most important thing to use for the lining is waterproof black gel ink pen for the lining part okay so let's start now here friends first of all using my black waterproof gelling pen we are going to start designing on a handmade paper sheet if you don't get a handmade paper sheet you can also use cartridge sheet which is used for drawing and other than that we are going to use a small scale and a compass for making circle so I'll start designing now first of all I'll find out a center of my page and start making circle leave some distance and make the next circle now after making the circles i'll start the drawing part Now I'll start drawing the next design. Now I'm going to start drawing another design.
So after drawing this design, I'm going to start drawing this part and again I'm going to use my scale for it. So friends, in the same way, I'll do the designing part all over uh, this uh, circle and then I'm going to show you how does it looks, okay? So friends, this is how our designing part looks when it has got completed and this is the final view of it. I have also made the scales on the fishes and the peacock and the whole design is finally completed. And now we are going to start coloring using Camelin Artist watercolors. This is a box of 18 shades. For this painting, we are going to require yellow, blue, green, black and orange colors. And these are the colors I have poured in my palette. So let's start now. First of all, I'm going to start coloring by orange. I'm going to color the center as orange. I'm going to use a green color. This is the dark green. And now I'm using light green color. I'm using dark green again. Now I'm going to use dark blue. I'm going to use light blue color. For the face I have to use dark blue because the light blue isn't looking that good. Now friends, I'm going to use a fabric cone liner and by using this it will be easy for me to color the thin and tiny lines. So I'm going to use it in this part. Now I'm going to use a golden liner. You can also use a yellow color liner if you have yellow acrylic liner. Now friends, after doing this part, now I'm going to color this using golden liner. So in the same way friends, we have to do the golden lining all over the circle. Till that, I'm going to color these parts as yellow. Now I'm using pink color for this flower design. So friends, after making this design, I'm going to improvise it, the fish part. I'm going to color the scale using the golden liner. I'm just going to make a single drop on the center of that scale. And I'm going to do the same with all the fishes. Make just a single drop without covering up the lines or the whole white part okay the white part also will be visible as well as the lines will, will be visible i'm going to use my black color to color the remaining part of the whole design 
okay friends so in the same way i'm going to do the all remaining part over here as black and then i'll show you the whole design how does it looks okay so yeah friends as you can see our madhubani painting is finally completed this is one of the best paintings i have made in madhubani painting because i have really upgraded the design and i just love the design and i have did with all the different kind of colors and materials i have used on the same paper i also got a texture like on the fish scales i also have got a texture because i have used this golden liner which also pops up pink color i just love the design i have did it and next for the external i have also used a acrylic pearl white color to color the white part and the frame i actually didn't got enough time to do the framing but i'm surely going to frame this part using a black border that's why for just showing you i have did the black color on the outer side so this is the full view of our madhubani painting please do tell me in the comments below how did you find this video if you did like this video friends please do like share and subscribe my channel thank you for watching